In today's local business spotlight, we are joined by Morgan Hill of Hill and Hill Financial, and we're talking about preparing for 2021 and part of that building a better retirement along the way as well. First question, Morgan, thanks for joining us. Oh, absolutely. Is, we're looking forward to 2021. A lot of folks yeah, are. Yeah. What do we need to be thinking about when it comes to our investments? Yeah, um, I think everybody's going to actually stay up till midnight 2020 to be sure that 2020 <laughs> is gone and 2021 actually arrives. Um, certainly after the election, and I'm not, I don't get political publicly or privately, it's just there's, no, there's enough yelling and screaming going on. But now that it appears that the election is, is behind mm -hmm. us and the market is responding um, to you know, kind of what's going on, I think it's a good time for people to begin to look at how they're really diversified. Now, traditionally, first of all, I'm a broker, I'm an insurance agent, I'm a fiduciary. Too often that just means I have this much stock and this much bonds. But I think people need to broaden that look to say, gosh, do maybe I have some alternative investments that don't move as the market moves. Maybe there's some fixed rate investments. How should I diversify domestically and globally? So maybe take a broader picture mm -hmm. as the market has kind of said, hey, listen, it looks like we're going to have some balance. That's what the market really likes. They like more certainty than uncertainty. Um, so I've been talking with a lot of our folks to say, let's have some good balance. And then people have been parking a lot of cash mm -hmm. on the sidelines, nervous about the election. Right. And this is probably a good time to get off the sidelines and say, Let, let's see how we might deploy that cash to do something for you rather than just sitting at a very, very low interest rate. And speaking of those interest rate and, and deploying that cash, of course, a response to COVID-19 this year is that yeah. the Federal Reserve really dropped those interest rates. Very much um, so. Do you look for those to stay low or how can we react right yeah. now? Can we do anything? Yeah, it's my understanding that the Fed uh, Chairman Jerome Powell, um, his term goes through 2022. They made a very quick response with COVID. And again, people can love it or hate it. But they said, we're going to drop interest rates to make money cheap. Mm -hmm. That would help businesses, you know, employ people, build plant and equipment, those types of things. I'm seeing projections, Jess, 2021, 2022, before there's even an inkling of thought about raising interest rates. Mm -hmm. And also the Fed is saying, we're going to be a little more liberal with how we interpret the things that would cause interest rates to rise. Mm -hmm. So all that to say with COVID, they want the economy to rebuild for people to start spending, people to go back and get their jobs, employers to open their doors, et cetera, safely. Yes. And so it's been real challenging for people to find good rates of return at a local bank or a credit union. So we often encourage people to not only look at you know, what's the best bank or credit union for safe, accessible money. But there are also some other good fixed rate investments, investments that we see around the country that could do better, but are still fixed and guaranteed. So again, other things are out there that are worth exploring with that available cash. And speaking of, you know, creating something safe and stable, how yeah. does the stock market play into all of this? You Gosh. know, what are some ways that we can utilize the stock market or some strategies in you that bet. realm? You bet. Uh, 2020, I feel like I, I've been um, on the what the mind bender or whatever ride it's six <laughs> yeah. flags or um, you know Kings Island or wherever but boy it's been a ride yes. if we look at the beginning of the year all the Dow Jones Industrial all the way to where it is now we're about at the same place we started again not unlike a roller coaster mm -hmm. but boy a lot of screaming a lot of folks got sick <laughs> right. along the way um, one of the things that we encourage folks to look at is um, there in the investing world there are things called beta models beta okay. investments that really look to minimize the risk, um, kind of soften the mm -hmm. volatility. Morgan, you have an offer for our viewers at home today, um, your book, Building a Better Retirement. Absolutely. How can we get if a you, copy? If you want to call our local number, which is uh, obviously 423-855-0270, or our 1-800 number, 800-887-9647. Those that call in will get a complimentary copy of the book, Building a Better Retirement, and if they need any help with any of their retirement planning needs, would love to schedule a time, and all of our consultations are a complimentary service. Perfect. All right, thanks again, and we'll talk to you real soon. Absolutely. Thanks, Jess.